But first, we are following breaking news out of Natomas, where crews are battling a fire at an apartment complex. CBS 13's Rob Malcolm is there. Rob, what can you tell us? Yeah, good evening, Sharina. It's still an active scene here. Just take a look behind me. I'm going to have kind of West pull up. You'll see here firefighters uh, still venting the roof uh, of this uh, apartment complex here. We did see some flames earlier on, but uh, they're kind of working on this roof now. This is what we know right now is that about 917, a call came in here to the River Terrace Apartments. Uh, this building is located at West El Camino and Mill Creek Drive. Uh, we do understand that the fire started downstairs in one of the units, and then it extended extended to the other buildings uh, inside. We do have some video that was uh, sent in by uh, Sacramento Fire, and you can see just an active situation of the flames here. We do understand that all of the residents in these apartment buildings did get out, but it's still an active scene here, and uh, I guess there's a lot of uh, activity around this apartment building because uh, a lot of people are still kind of getting out from the Aftershock concert, so we do notice uh, that when we were driving up here that firefighters had a hard time getting up the road because there's so much foot traffic and vehicle traffic uh, along Mill Creek Drive. Uh, but right now, it's still an active scene. We're trying to talk to a battalion chief to find out how this fire started, but it did uh, spread from uh, a first alarm to a second alarm, that initial call coming in at 917. So firefighters, right now, we do see a number of ladder trucks, pumper trucks, and a lot of hoses uh, extended to a lot of the fire hydrants here as they're trying to make quick work of this fire. We are also going to try to find out if we can talk to some of the residents here and try to find out from them how this fire started tonight. Sharon? Rob, pretty startling to see that apartment complex engulfed in flames, but good to know those people are doing okay.